What it do, YouTube? It's your boy Eyes and Ears Tactical, aka Mark Breezy. And I hope y'all having a good uh, Friday. Yeah, Friday. Happy St. Patrick's Day. Just letting y'all know. Uh, today, uh, if my mom was still with us, she would be 96 years old. This is her birthday. Uh, happy birthday to my mom, Maple Lee. Uh, love you, mom. Uh, she passed away six years ago. She was 90 years old when she passed away. She, had, she lived a long, fruitful life, a lot of grandkids, great grandkids, and she has seven children of her own. I'm the youngest of her seven. Um, she was the oldest of her siblings, and she had four siblings, three siblings plus her, so it's four total. So that's what I wanna get. Happy birthday to my mom. Y'all can drop a happy birthday to my mom. That'd be great. Heavenly, happy, happily, happy, heavenly birthday to my mom, Maple. And that's Maple, M-A-P-L-E, like maple syrup. So that's what I got for you guys. Anyway, as you can see, I'm doing, I got a different thing going on here. Uh, just let you know that I'm in a safe environment. Uh, just let you guys know my channel, there's no gun sales. Uh, today, uh, you know, like I said, I'm around the house in daylight. I pretty much rock with the uh, uh, Glock 29 10 mil. And then when it gets dark, I go into my home defense, which is my uh, Glock 21 45 ACP. Uh, this, this weapon is clear. There's a sights right there. Uh, a uh, very nice pistol. Um, 10 mil is a great, great uh, carry pistol. Really love this thing. Uh, so yeah, that's what I got for you guys. Uh, just want to say uh, shout out to all the, the gun tubers supporting my channel. Shout out to Yoki. Uh, she came through my channel and brought a lot of attention to me. So got a couple, pick up a few more subscribers. Uh, I was still building the channel. And like I said, the people that I shot y'all out, I just shot y'all because I like watching you guys' channel. And I uh, appreciate all of you guys. And then even the, the, even the big giant gun tubers, I, I, man, I got love for you guys too. Uh, Life with OB, uh, big, big Corey, big Corey, oh, big Corey Mo. They all big Corey out of Texas. And uh, a shout out to uh, uh, um, my, my, my man, uh, Seifu Lonzo, uh, you know, uh, Life with OB. So there's a lot of big gun tubers out there. And, you know, of course you can't leave out the president, uh, T Electric. You know, he'd be out there doing good things. So shout out to all you guys. So what I'm gonna start doing now on my channel, um, I'm gonna start, uh, well, I think, and I, I don't know how I'm gonna do it, but I'm basically gonna start uh, highlighting a YouTuber that I actually watch and do training stuff off. It didn't have to be training, but just somebody that, I, that I'm learning some stuff from. And I got this idea from Tactical Skillionaire. Okay, Jay Skilly, uh, uh, Skilly Nerd Tactical, yeah, so, uh, so yeah, Jay Skilly, so that's where I got this concept for him. His is a little, kind of like this, but mine, I'm, I'm actually, I'm, I'm gonna put up training stuff and information and stuff like that. His, he points out a lot of different things, so, you know, it's it's not a bite or anything, it's just something I thought was a great idea, I'm gonna do it. So if today's for my first episode, and for my two, I'm gonna point out, is gonna be my man Trent, the Gun Huddix. Uh This is his page right here, you can see, and we're gonna just roll through a couple of videos. I, what I like about this guy is he does real live, like practical situations where you would be doing certain things and he puts up a lot of cool shorts. So let's go ahead and jump into one right here. Let's go with, uh, uh, let's go with this one right here. <clears throat> Look at the execution on his draw. I'm a, I, I carry appendix, so this is part of the reason why I, uh, I watch him, because he's an appendix carrier. <clears throat> You can just tell he does a lot of practice, and I believe he's, I believe he's rocking a Glock 23. I talked to him before. I think he, he does with a Glock 19, but he also uses a Glock 23. I don't know what he got right there, but that might be his Glock 23. Let's go to another one. All right, here we go. Someone's probably saying, why would you need to practice that? Well, you never know. You might find yourself with some, with some, with some assailants on top of you. You gotta get them off of you. That's the beauty of appendix carry. A lot of people don't carry appendix, so a lot of these knucklehead bad guys, they may not even check you there. All right, let's go to another one. This one is called exiting through a window. There's some shit that might actually happen. You never know. So this guy does a, a lot of stuff like this. Let's go over here to another one. Go 
door to lock, Doc. You gotta go out the other way. Everything is something that can possibly happen. So you gotta still keep it moving. All right, let's go to another one. You saw that one hand, take the seat belt off, other hand, stay on target. Other hand opens the door. Good stuff. Let's see here. Hold on. Let's see another one. Okay. Now that's for that, that one I've skipped, but that one's for practicing on your balance. Let's see here. Okay. A little knife work right there. Get to your gun. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Stab and shoot. Stab and shoot. So don't sleep on your knife. Have your knife all on you, too, because that's the, that, the knife gets you to your gun. It's kind of like your, your pistol gets you to your rifle. Uh, let's see here. Okay. Hand shooting, I've been working on this too. So yet you can see he works on every position, every every possible technique, uh, and speed and execution, the draw is on point. So yeah, this is my guy Trent. Remember, y'all go ahead and, and go to this page, uh, subscribe, like, comment, hit the notification bell, support this brother, he's a really good brother. Uh, yeah, so yeah. So that's what I got for, for uh, my man Trent, and I'm gonna be doing that uh, periodically, you know, I don't know how I'm going to do it once a week, once a month, but I'm going to point out a couple YouTubers that are doing some good training information and showing people how to be safe and be sharp and and, and, and practical in practical situations. But a lot of us live in urban areas. Now, I realize a lot of y'all live in the South and in Florida where it's a little more woodsy, but you know, I got a funny feeling a lot of us do live urban. So a lot of these applications can be applied. So I shout out to Crank Gun Hugs, man. Uh, yeah. Um, another thing I want to point out is uh, get a little small, you know, like I tell you guys, I'm building my ammo up, so I'm going to try to build it all up so when I get to the summer and I start doing all this competition shooting and going out to the desert, I ain't going to have to be buying ammo, and I've just got, I got this theory where I'm going to get everything up to about a thousand each, every caliber, and then I'll shoot a lot of that out, and then in the, in the, in the fall, I'll reload it all back up again and prepare for the summer, so I'm going to keep my regiment dry fire, dry fire, range, range, and then dry fire, dry fire. So I got a little system going to do working gear. So today a little, little haul. I shot, yes, yeah, you know, I shot my 10 mil over the week. So I got I had to reload this a little bit. Uh, got these right here. Okay. 10 mil. These are jacket and hollow points. Uh, what is that? 180 grain. Let's pick up a box of that. Uh, they were 33. They kind of went up in price. I, I, they were at 27 at one point. So then I got these right here. Uh, Winchester, nine mil, 115 grain. Uh, this was like $16 a box, something like that. Uh, then I picked up a box of the 40, Morty Smith, Smith and Wesson, 180 grain. Uh, so yeah, and I think these were uh, 17 or 20, uh, $20 a box. So 20 for the 40, uh, 14, I think 15 for the nine and uh, 10 mil. Uh, was that uh, 33 or something like that. So yeah, just slowly stockpile your ammo up. That way you never, if some shit pop off, you'll be ready to go. And then you won't have to worry about growing, grabbing ammo and all that kind of crazy stuff. Guys, I just want to let you guys know, channel's doing good. Uh, I'm going to do a giveaway. I'm going to do a giveaway when I get to 500. I'm going to give away the scope I got right here. Uh, was it C C V Life or C Life? I don't even know how to pronounce it. Maybe y'all can know if y'all from here. I bought it. Uh, nothing wrong with it. I just I had it. I was going to use it on one of my 22 LRs, but I went to a RMR Red Dot. I just thought this was a little bit too long. So brand new in the box. Let's just take it out. Uh, it's a really nice scope. Uh, as you can see, it's brand new. I, I mounted it and shot it one time. It zeroed out and everything, but I just found it to be a little cumbersome on my on my 22. So I. I didn't want it. I didn't want it no more. So this is it right here. I'm trying to see if I can. Oh, first of all, I got the cap on. 
But yeah, so let's see here. Let's see if we can get up in there. But nonetheless, this is it right here. Good, good, good aircraft aluminum. Uh, that's the company. All the specs. Uh, I'm not going to go through all of it, but it's a good product. Um, you know, you got your windage elevation. So yeah, I'm going to give this away when I get the uh, 500 subscribers. And I'll, so you know, you guys go ahead, pass it around, let some people know. You know, when I get to 500, whoever it is. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and give this thing out and I'm gonna do a couple more of the giveaways along the line I got a, a red dot. Uh, it's not a hollow center like that. It was another company made out of Oregon and I had it on my Glock 19. It's you don't have to cut your slide But I had I couldn't really operate it the way I liked it because I'm so used to iron sights But it's brand new in the box and it's it, you know, it's a budget uh, Red dot that you can mount your pistol. It comes with the little plates so you don't have to really cut your slide and I'm gonna give that away too. This thing ain't going back up in here, right? Anyway, I'll do that later. But uh, yeah, so I'm gonna give that away. So a lot of new things coming up with the channel, giveaways, stuff like that. Uh, just wanna let you guys know, uh, it's you still wanna be safe around your house, in your environment, approaching your car, your home, going out the door and all that kind of stuff. And then keep your eye out for, you know, people that are looking kind of shady in your environment and you should be all right. But that's what I got for you guys. So again, check out my man Trent, the Gun Hunnicks. Go ahead and check him out. I'll be doing this. I'll be highlighting some tubers. Uh, he's he's a pretty big YouTuber. I don't, I don't know how many subscribers Trent has. I think he's probably somewhere. He might be ten thousand or something. I don't know. He's pretty big, but I won't go really go big YouTubers unless they really got some training material. I'm not going to just put up a guy just showing guns or a girl shooting showing guns. I'm going to pretty much show people that can have some stuff we can learn. So, but I'm trying to find guys that are under a thousand subscribers to help them grow their channel, and then I'll, maybe I can get a big YouTuber to come in with me and help highlight some of these, these uh, YouTubers that are on the ride. Again, Trent's not a small YouTuber like myself. He's a big YouTuber. Uh, I think he, he, you know, like I said, I don't know, I haven't checked his numbers, but I think he's well over 10,000. Uh, I'm well under 500, so. So that's the concept, guys, and I just wanna thank you guys for stopping by the channel. If you like the content, go ahead, uh, like, comment, subscribe, the notification bell so you can be uh, alerted on whenever I drop some new information and new content. Uh, then you can share the video if you want, whatever you wanna do, pass it around, it's all good. But hey, man, y'all stay blessed and have a nice weekend. It's your boy, uh, Eisenhower Tactical. Always have your eyes and always have your ears. Be safe at all times. Be ready at all times. Peace. Y'all have a good time.